you start out keeping about 90% of the weight on your front foot and then hip alignment. So from here, I don't want to end up with my hip way behind my foot because then as I step into my knee drive, I'm going to end up falling back and using way too much hamstring. What I want to do is keep us closer to our mid stance position. So the hip could be right behind the ankle and then as we pull, we're going to be in mid stance. And then right back down. So there's a lot of movement going on with this leg, but the opposite hip is not traveling much distance. So choose a weight that you can be very stable with and be very clean with the pattern. This is not about strength, this is about trying to coordinate some of the strength you've built into a pattern that's going to have more crossover into your running. Start in the center, a little bit of torso rotation, hips are nice and stable. As I rotate, drive the knee up, and then back to my start position. We do want to drive that knee above 90 degrees of hip flexion, so we can get to those hip flexors up above 90 like the psoas. So 